Let's check out this nice new update of Ethos 1.2. Welcome to Ethos. Where have my model images gone? Right, so some of you guys may have updated to Ethos 1.2. If you've done it via my video, you'll know what's happened and how to fix this anyway. But if you've updated just off your own back or through some other method, and you found that your model images are now just showing a sort of gray default image, this is how to get them back. What's basically happened is that the folder has been renamed in the EFOS and it actually makes a lot more sense now. But to actually fix this, we're gonna to need to plug into the computer. Because we're on 1.2, there's a nice easy way of doing this. We don't need to go into bootloader anymore. We can just plug in our USB. And on our screen, I'm just gonna choose Free Sky Suite. So let's go down to Free Sky Suite and we get a USB icon and our drives are now getting detected by Windows. So let's open up Windows Explorer and what we'll have now is our flash drive, our SD card, and if you're using an X18, uh, you'll ha also have a NAND drive. Now, depending on which transmitter you've got and where you've decided to store your files, the, the location will be slightly different. On X20s, Horus, uh, all that sort of stuff, we'll be looking on the SD card. But if you've got an X18 and have chosen to use the NAND storage or the internal storage for your model images, you'll need to look on there. So I'm just gonna to go to the SD card and we're looking for this bitmaps folder. And in here we have a folder called user, which you may know from the past installations, if you want to have a model image and you've downloaded it from the internet, this is the folder you put it in. What we need to do is rename this folder. So you can press F2 on your keyboard or right click and go to rename. <laughs> rename. And we're gonna call it models. This is all we need to do. Now, when we look at our transmitter, the images will be back. So I'm not even going to sort of do anything special. I'm gonna hold it up to the screen. I'm gonna unplug it. It will restart and you see straight away the model image has come up. So nice, quick, easy video. If you're having this problem, this is how to fix it. Thank you for watching, guys. If you did find this video useful, please remember to give it a thumbs up and also click the subscribe and bell icon to help get this video out to more people. And fly models like you stole them. Have a great time. See ya.